CNN Newsroom, formerly known as World Report, World News and Your World Today, is the main newscast program airing on CNN International from Atlanta, London, Hong Kong and Los Angeles. The show airs Mondays to Fridays from 1 a.m. to 4:30 a.m. US Eastern Time and various time slots during weekends. It is also simulcast on CNN, US every Monday mornings from 2 a.m. to 4 a.m. Eastern Time and on weekends from 4 a.m. to 6 a.m. Eastern Time. The weekday edition's first hour or second hour from March to November, named on air in the Philippines as Newsroom International to avoid confusion with the locally based newscast is simulcast Mondays to Fridays from 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on CNN Philippines. In Hong Kong, it will be a 30-minute simulcast Mondays to Fridays from 1 p.m. to 1.30 p.m. HKT and Saturdays and Sundays from 12 p.m. to 12.30 p.m. and 5 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. HKT on VIA TVSIX. <laughs> Previous incarnations CNN International's main newscast brand for much of the 1990s was simply called World News. In the late 1990s, the network introduced two editions of CNN This Morning. The first edition was broadcast from the studio in Hong Kong, and the second edition was broadcast from their production center in London. Both editions were intended to be morning programs for Asia and Europe, respectively. After a revamp of CNN International in 2001, the program was split into two and was renamed. The Asian program was named NewsBiz Today, anchored by Christy Lou Stout and Stan Grant in Hong Kong, while the European program was named BizNews, and was anchored by Hala Garani and Richard Quest in London. CNN International underwent another revamp in 2004. In March of that year, NewsBiz Today and BizNews were both renamed to CNN Today. Topic: <laughs> CNN Today 2004 to 2009. At its start, the Asian edition ran for three and a half hours, later reduced to just three hours, and the European edition ran for three hours. In both editions, the show had six segments between breaks every hour. At the top of the hour, both editions cover the top stories of the morning. The second segment in the Asian edition takes a look at business headlines and introduces the first of three weather updates. Its third and fourth segments looks more in-depth at some top stories. The fifth segment continues with some technology and more business headlines, and sports and lighter stories as well as the business traveler's weather advisory are given before the hour ends. The European edition has its first weather update before the first break and continues with major news reports on the second segment. Business stories are reported before the bottom of the hour. At the bottom of the hour, world news headlines are recapped before going to more in-depth coverage of current issues. A second weather report is also presented at this time. Like the Asian edition, sports stories and the business traveler's weather advisory are presented before the top of the hour. In late 2004, the anchor lineups were changed. Monitor Rajpal, who was based at CNN Centre in Atlanta, moved to London to present the European edition with Richard Quest, while Hala Garani subsequently moved to Atlanta. In early 2005, Quest stepped down as anchor to become a special correspondent, and Max Foster was hired to anchor the European edition with Rajpal. As for the Asian edition, Stan Grant left CNN in 2012 to return to Australia. Hugh Rimmington, another Australian, was hired to anchor the Asian edition with Christy Lou Stout. During the Rimmington Lou Stout era, the program won the Asian Television Award for Asia Pacific's Best News Program. Topic: 2008 Refresh. CNN International began another revamp of the channel in late 2008. 
Starting in September, the Asian edition reverted to a single anchor format. Christy Loostout presented the first two hours, while Hugh Rimmington anchored the last hour of the Asian edition and the first hour of the European edition. Also, the European edition was reduced by another 30 minutes for World Sport. The remaining 30 minutes aired after World Sport, and Max Foster anchored those last 30 minutes solo. As a result, Hong Kong produces four hours of CNN Today, while London produces a cumulative two hours of CNN Today. The anchoring lineups changed once again. Lou Stout was on maternity leave for most of the end of 2008, and Kaushal Patel relieved for her. Christy Lou Stout returned in January 2009, and Patel returned to Atlanta and later left the network. Anna Koren was hired from Seven Network in December 2008, and began presenting the third hour of the program. On a related note, Hugh Rimmington left CNN after four years with the channel and returned to Canberra, Australia to become the chief political correspondent for Network 10. Christy Lou Stout anchors the Asian Evening Bulletins, while Koren anchors mostly the Asian Morning Bulletins. The newly shortened European edition also changed anchors. Monitor Rajpal and Max Foster left the program in April 2009. Don Riddle, a London-based sport anchor for CNN and Zane Vergee, then CNN State Department correspondent in Washington, became the anchors of the program. Rajpal now anchors World Report later in the morning, while Foster is a special correspondent and relief anchor for Connect the World, an evening program and other shows. The European edition now features a new, lighter format for its first 90 continuous minutes. Sasha Herriman presents a lighter story a few times throughout the program and often provides a look at the front pages of London's newspapers. The sport update is now shown on the show, and later the morning Asia, European Time World Business Today anchored by Charles Hodson and Andrew Stevens appears. <laughs> World Report 2009 On September 21, 2009, all editions of CNN Today, Your World Today and World News were rebranded as World Report. Another television series of the same name, World Report, was renamed as World View at the same time. Initially, there were multiple editions airing per day, at 0000, 0200, 0500, 0600, 0700, 0800, 0900, 1200, 1300 and 1700 all times GMT. However, as CNN International's schedule evolved, these airtimes were reduced to weekend editions, and an Asian and European morning edition. Anna Koren and Pauline Chiu anchored the Asian edition during these times. The Asian morning edition of World Report was rebranded as CNN Newsroom in November 2012, to coincide with the revamp of CNN's Hong Kong studio, and the introduction of a new anchor team of Andrew Stevens and Patricia Wu. Asian edition anchor Anna Koren received the 2011 Asian Television Award for Best News Presenter or Anchor for her work on the series. Topic: <inaudible> CNN Newsroom 2013 present. Effective June 17, 2013, all editions of World Report and World One were renamed CNN Newsroom. The new show was branded with new graphics, and originally used the previous World Report theme music, although this was changed quickly to the World One music. <laughs> CNN Today 2014 -present. On November 3, 2014, instead of October 20, as first reported, the Asian Morning Block was rebranded to CNN Today anchored by Michael Holmes and Amara Walker at the network's headquarters in Atlanta. <laughs> Current personalities 
equals equals former personalities <laughs>